Baltimore removed Confederate monuments overnight under the cover of darkness. The city is part of a growing movement around the country. It is gaining momentum after the white supremacist demonstration in Charlottesville, Virginia, that left one counter protester dead. Crews in Baltimore took down four monuments, including a prominent statue of Generals Robert E. Lee and Stonewall Jackson. Juliana Goldman is there in Baltimore. Juliana, good morning. Good morning. Overnight, city workers and contractors removed four Confederate statues from across the city. Uh, here, we spoke with one person who was here uh, overnight. They told us it took three hours to remove statues of Robert E. Lee uh, and Stonewall Jackson. As you can see behind me, all that's left now is a base covered in graffiti. Uh, there was a small crowd on hand here last night, and this decision came after the Baltimore City Council passed a resolution on Monday, which was approved by the mayor, who said that she did this in the middle of the night to avoid the violent class clashes in Charlottesville. Uh, this is all part of a larger effort in cities nationwide, but particularly in the South, to take down these Confederate symbols. Elected officials from Lexington, Kentucky, to North Carolina, to Birmingham, Alabama, are ordering the removal of these statues. Uh, in Birmingham, the mayor ordered the city to board up the Confederate Sailors and Soldiers Monument. Now, here at this site, people have been coming by all morning. Uh, people have been driving by, honking and cheering. Uh, some of the people who have been coming by here are taking pictures, some in support of the moves overnight, others not so much. All right. Thank you very much, Juliana.